that want to be a hero, step it up. I don't want to hear you people with your clubs tonight, so I want you to take those hands and sit on them, because no one wants to hear it. Ladies and gentlemen, this is our main event of the evening. On the outside of the ring, please welcome Silas Young. And his tag team partner, he is the Wisconsin homewrecker. He's the king of sticking it in. This is Strick Nine. And their opponents this evening. A couple of Hellraisers right here in this corner from Las Vegas, Nevada. The real deal, Jay Jensen. And hailing from Orland Hills, this is Maverick! Referee Lockparto. You know, before we get started with our commentating in this main event, I got a bone to pick. What qualifications? Why is an ordained minister at ringside? He's not a licensed manager. He has no business here. He, he's allowed to travel any grounds he feels. Tommy Lee has no reason here. I don't care if he's an ordained minister or not. He has, does not have a manager's license, and he should not be here. But now, on serious note, I've been told by my main man, Strick Nine and Silas Young, that their strategy today is they're going to hit the real deal and Maverick with so many rights, they're going to be begging for the left by the end of the night. And starting off the real deal, Jay Jensen, grappling with Silas Young. I tell you what, Billy Wack, I've known Maverick, Maverick for a long time. I, he's been out of the ring for four years. I can't wait to see him get back in here. He looks in tremendous shape from the last time I saw him. He really looks like he's slimmed out for this match. He absolutely. Whereas his tag team partner took the opposite approach and slimmed up. Oh, come on now. Wait, you slimmed up. Apparently, Job of the Hut is over in Steger. That's the real deal, Jay Jensen built. Job of the Hut with the beard. And originally tonight, it was supposed to be Silas Young versus Strick Nine. But Commissioner Mike Nolan signed off. And now we have a main event of the SUVs, the straight up villains, against Silas and Strick Nine. And to be honest, I gotta give Nolan some credit. That's probably the smartest thing he's ever done in his life. Because these two guys are friends. They should be fighting each other. They should be tearing apart this mediocre, washed up tag team that no one cares about. I don't know why an ordained minister's out there. He's got no business. None. The ordained minister's out there in case he has to minister something. <laughs> he obviously needs to go to the gym with the SUVs and start training. Look at them little toothpicks he calls arms. Did you ever notice that whenever you talk, it's like... Like... Yes. The ordained minister curses the microphone. He's responsible for all your feedback folks this evening. You better believe that. Oh, I'm scared of a guy with spaghetti noodles for arms. Come get me, Mr. Minister. Oh no. Ooh. Why don't you worry about your team? You know, I bet the ordained minister could allow the marriage between you and Blitz John Stone. Oh dude, I don't know where you're going with that, and I don't like it. First of all, we're not gay, we just like to hug. Jensen tried to get up and he couldn't. He used his little weight to trip him. He's got Silas Young reeling now. Come on, make the tag to Maverick. We all want to see him in there. Whoa. And Jensen. And Silas caught up in those ropes. Now to the outside. 
I tell you what, I think this is more of a break for Jay Jensen than is Silas Young. I think he worked up a little sweat with them flurry of offensive moves and now he needs a little breather. Yes, I agree. Well, look at him. Jensen's an athlete. He's in tip-top drinking shape. Strychnine helping Silas Young get back in the ring. You know, they got a 20 count. They're going to use it. They're not going to get in this ring. And look at that. The tag was made. I don't think Joe saw it, and he shouldn't allow it. I didn't see a tag either. Jensen spitting blood here on the outside. I think everyone's been waiting to see this. Maverick's return to a wrestling ring. I'm, I'm interested to see what he can do, if he still has it. And Maverick wants a piece of silence. Yeah, Strick Nine still, still hanging out on the outside. I would think this ordained minister hanging out with Maverick would at least hang out with him at the gym and not the bar. I, I'll tell you right now. I've known Maverick a long time. If they're going to try to match strings with Maverick and Jay Jensen, they're going to lose. Now, now, correct me if I'm wrong, this is the first time Maverick has wrestled in like, what, four years? Probably the last time he wrestled, I whooped him so bad he never wanted to get back in there. I don't believe that for a second. Strict Nine stretching it out. He is the Wisconsin home wrecker. He's a natural athlete. Look at him. Look at him. He's in top tip shot, top shape. And he's going to get loose, stretch those muscles, make sure he doesn't injure himself while he's injuring man. Right. Slow it down. See, but Strict Nine has experience. Strict Nine's been in there for the four years that Maverick wasn't. That's right. Maverick made a little ring rust right there, not you know, at his wits. Not when he should have. Ooh, a big clothesline. Well, I tell you what, this is the Maverick I remember. He can take a whooping. He's like the time that's watch. He keeps takes a lick and it keeps on ticking. Look at him. I gotta got wonder if Maverick has uh, decided maybe coming back wasn't such a good idea. I tell you what, this is an interesting strategy from Strip Nine and Silas. I would be working over Jay Jensen, who I don't think is the strong man of the team, but they got the inexperienced man, so to speak, with the four years off, and it looks like they're just gonna work him as a team and wear him down and try to get this victory. Maverick's turned this into a bar room brawl like he should. Fans are chanting EPW, Elite Pro Wrestling. Oh yeah. Oh, a shot right in the balls of Jay Jensen. Allegedly. I've, I've always wanted to say that on a microphone. Tonight was my night. I tell you what, Maverick looked good in that ring, but now I think he needs an oxygen tank. And you can see Strick Nine on the outside. He's hurt too, or he's winded at least. Well, I tell you what, Maverick laid out a good old fashioned butt whooping. It's a testament to the intestinal fortitude of Silas on the Strick Nine that they're still breathing. But 
pound for pound, Maverick might be the strongest mother trucker in this company. Silas Young with a, a very cocky pin there. Loosen him, they know, they know the real deal. He's like the, the 32nd man. He's pretty good for 30 seconds, but much after that, he, he can wear him down. You can get him. You just gotta keep him in the ring. Oh no. You know, that's perfectly legal using that rope. <laughs> look, at, look at Joe's worried about his shirt. Hot <laughs> poor Joe. Well, he spent his last payday on it. He doesn't want to buy a new one. Oh, they don't pay Joe. And look at the stomping, stomping of Strict Nine. Jensen with that boot. Jensen right now is just doing anything to survive. He's got to make a tag to Maverick. He has to make a tag. Look at that, you see that wow. ring move? He might have broke Jensen's back. Yeah, you get that ornate minister out of the way, Strict Knight. He's up to no good. We get security, we kick him. He has authority from the highest power to be here, Bill Patrick. He has no authority, he has no manager's license, he has no arms, he has no brain, he has no clue. And Strict Knight, oh man, oh man. You're never going to pin Jay Jensen with a sloppy pin like that. you got to get your weight on his girth. Jesus. Jensen off the ropes. And now Silas Young, what's he going to do? Big elbow. Nice double team, team tag team. And you can tell these guys are friends and they work pretty good as a unit. They got that nice movement together. Really. It's like they're thinking the same thing. They're on the same page. So Who's that, Silas and Strick? That is correct. Well, they, they said they were good friends. Of course they're in sync. No, not the band. No, 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 no not the band. No. And again, a chokehold is perfectly legal here in EPW. trying to survive right now. He's going on instinct and instinct alone. They gotta turn this back into a car room roll to the dead room. The SUVs are the most dangerous. That was just more for show, showing off for all the ladies in the crowd. Now they gotta count a five there, the little, little Joey. Ooh. Strict nine with those big meaty forearm flubbings. No one wants to see a full moon today. Well, the ultimate sign of disrespect. He's choking him out with his red kerchief. See, Maverick's got to wait. He can't get in there. There are some rules. He's got to be tagged to get in there. And while well, Maverick is distracting the referee, they are just taking apart the real deal, Jay Jensen. Ring the bell. I hear Jensen quit. He's quit. Ring the bell. Ring the bell. Like, but nevertheless, Strict Nine had to be feeling the effects of those headbutts. I would think so. But hopefully, if that's his whole record set. Oh! 
a heart kick by Silas Young. Just playing with him, and I believe he caught him with the heel of the foot there. Hey, what are you doing? Why did you get out of here? Jensen's begging for his life. He has to make that tag. He's inches away. Inches away. So yes, close. So far. Here it is. Maddox out of fire. The southpaw is really coming out. He's well rested, full of energy. A flapjack! One, two, three. Oh, Silas. Coming Jensen to the outside. Now they got Jensen on the outside gasping for air. It'll be at least two minutes before he gets back in the ring. And now they're double teaming Maverick like a good team should. And the ordained minister Tommy Lee over here helping out. Now I'm going to keep my eyes on this minister. I think he's, he's going to give them a foreign object of some sort because he's up to no good. to do that, they just should have wrestled each other. That's gotta be it, that could be it, one, two. That slight, that slight hesitation by Maverick cost him right there, that slight pause. He should have nailed him with that power slam and pinned him immediately. I agree. If Silas wants a timeout, I don't blame him. He should, he should get about five minutes to regroup. And Maverick spinning to the outside right over there. You know, I still don't understand why this ordained minister Tommy Lee's out there. So far, he's done nothing. He's added nothing. He is just useless. Oh, God. Look at this action on the outside over here. Paul. Jensen just said Paul. That means he's hurt. He's hurt. Lockport Joe's got to take control of this match. Get these guys back in the ring where they belong. Strict knock choking on the rail right here in front of us. broke his hand. That is steel he just hit. Hey, look at Jensen in the ring. Oh. That's a lot of weight Strick Nine just picked up. Sure is. He's oh screaming God. for his life. Paul Strick Nine has to do his roll over and get the pin. No thanks. Oh my God! You think that's his holy water? You think that's the holy water? It might, it could very well be. Silas breaking up the pin so close. Jensen, what's he doing? He's trying to get to the top. I tell you right now, if he gets to the top of that rope, he might go through the ring. I think Jensen's taking a nap. Jensen needs he's a out of gas. He's winded. Someone help the real deal. <laughs> Look at Jensen. Jensen trying to get his footing. What's he going to do? 
Jay Jensen will not be confused for a luchador. So close, yet so far. I'm telling you, Joe can't count to three. It's in his contract. And I don't know how strict Nyla Silas Young kicked out of that. They got a lot of intestinal fortitude, obviously. John Jagger from Silas Young. A do -si -do. Look at the SUVs in the corner of Silas Young. Swick line. Jensen hit them both. I tell you what, the SUVs, they had to have done some training because they look pretty good right now working as a unit. I they are have to definitely agree. not showing the four years of ring rust.
Riley. Look at that. I lied. Oh, I thought you said Nicholas H. Watch, those watch, are Nicholas watch. H.'s motorcycles. Um, oh, yeah, everybody thought that was all wow. He went up in front of an animal. The corner gets a big boot up right in the face of the mush. Oh, a big clothesline by animal. There's my friend. It's his ass. Look at my ass. Look at him. All right. That's great. That's great. Kurt Henning had dream night. What a star-studded event it must have been. Yeah. And, uh, emanating some sort of an odorific emanation from his mouth. <laughs> Ooh, whoa. Oh, 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 that kick <laughs> sticks it in. Here we go. go. He got him up. Oh, oh the doomsday device. Oh, oh down he goes. Oh, oh, the top rope. This is he's going to fly. Oh. He's going to fly. Oh. He takes off his head. Got to love it. One, two, two three. Yeah, big win for the Road Warriors right there at the first dream night.